this is the way how we're going to check uh, panel specification uh, first we need to check our uh, work order which is the shop drawing this is what we call shop drawing and this is what we have here enclosure type uh, NEMA 4x outdoor form 1 free standing panel okay so name of the panel it depends what is the name of the panel which you wish so here as what you see here name of the panel is LP03 so you will find in this area so this is the name of the panel so this is out uh, door so this is outdoor panel with this NEMA 4x so right over here you will find also if you are going to open our drawing you will find the size of panel so okay so in this area you will find from here okay so this is the panel size okay and what are the components side you can easily identify in here just in case there's a discrepancy with this the location of the actual components inside is not the same you need to do the markup in order to incorporate in as built drawing what is in as built drawing as built drawing is to incorporate the built-in components where is the location it should reflect to the actual location and also the drawing should be the same like for example here you will find i have some markup in this area stick mark with this check 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 stick mark so this is the panel system voltage also you will find from here and the degree of protection okay so right over here this is you will find whatever available inside so here this is front view so right over here we are going to check the actual location of the component so right over here this is what we call the incomer one okay so this is incomer which is the main breaker you will find from here this is the up here all right and this is the cd okay and this is the branch okay this is the branch breaker which is what we have it f1 and f2 all right and this is the wiring components all right and at this side we have also the panel lighting okay this is panel lighting and the limit switch okay and this is the components which is fit on the metering door this is what we call digital meter and this is the socket okay so you will find in this area okay so we have also indication lamp ryb red yellow blue and the indicate and the digital meter and the selector switch moa means manual off and automatic and we have the socket switch okay so right over here this is on the first section and this is on the second section you will find this is the branch okay so i will explain to you in the uh, uh, second phase of the drawing you will find here this is the branch f13 and this is contactor branded with c1 and this is a branch breaker switch is fit from uh, f13 branch breaker through contactor so here available here and these are the branches you will find from here up here it is you can easily identify this is c pen all right so here right over here okay so here you will find also an incoming wires will this available in this area so here branded with e1 e2 e3 means this is for line one line two okay and this is for line three and this is our neutral bus bar e0 means e0 neutral bus bar and our ground bus bar at the bottom you will find the ground which is branded with earth Label with earth in the neutral you will find from that so here is the opening plant lid fine and should be our internal cabinet through enclosure the door should be airtight for the protection okay so you will find from here so how to identify the face of the breaker so in the breaker you will find l1 l2 l3 which is l1 red l2 yellow l3 is the blue one okay so right over here you will find also our single line diagram so in single line diagram you will find what the bend for here okay single line diagram here in camera three phase four wire 60 hertz with this you will find from here okay and then here 
This is the branch uh, rated uh, main bus bar carriage. It's 125 ampere for the main bus bar, which is you will find from here. This is what we call the main bus bar. All right. Okay. So here, this is the branch, which is F1 and F2 should be 20 ampere, and you will find 20 ampere in this side. Oh, I see. 20 ampere. This F2 and this is F1. The same. And after that, you will find this F13, which is available here, 63 ampere, 125 ampere. 63 ampere, 125 ampere frame, F13, so that's it. And after that, F13 from contactor, F13 going to contactor, so as what you see here, these wires going through here, going to contactor, and from contactor, going to branch all right okay so that is a uh, feed through contactor from f13 okay so what are the components inside the components and the uh, schematic diagram you will find from here this is the simple schematic diagram okay Right. so you will find where are the uh, materials we are going from and also the wiring points connection okay okay at this uh, at this page you will find also this f13 circuit you will find from here this f13 mccb triple 63 ampere 125 ampere frame AT means for ampere trip, AF for ampere frame, which is you will find also here. Okay, so you will find the 63 ampere and 125 ampere frame, including the model. And you will find also in shop drawing, this is what we call schematic diagram. You will find here the photo cell control, okay, contactor C1 means contactor timer, which is available also, and PE panel, this is photo cell. You will find here C1 contactor which is fit through here from contactor going to branch breaker. So here you will find there and the timer you will find from here. This is T1 and these are the control fuses. Okay. F1 up to FU6 and this is MCB. Okay, and this is the terminal block for the C which is connected through here okay current transformer okay this is the sensor to sense the load okay and this here the uh, terminal blocks as what you see here black red white this is the wire going to our uh, photo cell which is available here the photo cell okay and here and this is a panel lighting okay so that's it and then these are the point to point so once uh, the bolt and nut are tightened already so you will find the torque marking which is to ensure that the bolt are already uh, tight properly okay so that's it for today and we will uh, continue on my next video thank you for watching